Hi, I'm DustBowler49, and welcome to episode 15 of my Let's Play of Spire the Dragon. In this episode, I'm going to be completing the third boss, Blowhard and Crystal Flight. So let's enter here. And remember that there are no fodder animals in boss levels, so I'm going to have to try extra hard not to get hit. In the first area of oops, this level, the only enemies are these little green wizards, so there's nothing too hard to deal with, and after you hit the boss the first time, there's only druids, so what you really have to be concerned about is Blowhard himself, and if you get your timing right, he's not too difficult. Just make sure these guys don't hit you, like, I should be more careful than what I'm be being now. Okay, so, I almost got hit quite a bit of times there. Okay, so, I took care of the first couple enemies. Oops. That incident, and so with Blowhard, what you're gonna want to do is hop and flame him, and you should not get hit. I'm just going back to make sure I've gotten all the treasure, because in this level it's really irritating to have to go back and search. Don't forget any of the treasure along this little path. And here are our druids. Just make sure when you hop to these platforms that they are down, and of course up when you want to hop to the next one. I'm just being extra careful. Okay, so in this room to our right is our one and only dragon for Blowhard. I'm just going to grab him before I move on. Thanks for releasing me, Sparrow. You have no idea how long I've been trapped in crystal. And, uh, neither do I. Who are you again? Um, I'm out of here. So with these next platforms, what I like to do is wait till they come right next to me, and then I walk directly on them. You don't have to hop to them. So again, just be careful and walk towards it. And this is the last obstacle with the druids. And on this little wooden path, make sure you go to the left before you move on because there's a whole bunch of treasure chests over here. And right here on this platform is the second time we faced Blowhard. So again, remember to jump to flame him. And again, I didn't get hit, luckily. This is going pretty good so far. Normally I get hit just about every time. I forgot to hit that fire chest, fire works chest and there's a 10 gem in there so you won't want to forget it here's our last time hitting blowhard oh that was scary crap i'm gonna go up here first hope he can't chase me that would be scary okay so i really don't want to get hit by him i've worked so hard not to this whole time hey look Oh, I got hit. I'm gonna turn around. He won't go down. I can't hit him if he's up like that. Oops, hit something. He won't come down. Okay. Okay, hit him. I wish I didn't get that last time, but it is what it is. So I'm gonna hopefully have all the treasure. I do. And I'm gonna head now to Crystal Flight. Okay, so I should get. Oh, here, goat. Uh, okay, so I killed a goat, so I have some more life. And I'm gonna head over to Crystal Flight, and all you have to do is go through this door and to the right. And it is right here. So I'm gonna fly in this portal. So 
we're gonna go through the circles first. And next is arches. Just have to be careful not to hit anything and fall into the water. Otherwise, this one's pretty easy. So I think I have one more arch and then planes. So I'm running out of time. Crap. I should be able to make this. Hopefully. So the, the treasure chests here are the last thing we have to collect. And I've got three more. Here's our last one. And that's it for Crystal Flight. Okay, so that's it for Magic Crafters. In the next episode, I'll be taking you to Beast Keepers. No, Beast Makers. I'm, I keep on combining all the names. I don't want to save, actually. So, over here is the balloonist for beast makers, not beast keepers. That would be a whole different thing, wouldn't it? I'm gonna get rid of these. I don't want a sneak attack on me. So, here's the balloonist. And in episode, I believe, 16, we'll go to beast makers. So, thanks for watching. Bye now.